When we create a new repository using the create next app, this is the kind of folder structure that we get. If we come to any file and write some code like this, even though I'm creating a variable a that I'm never using, and also I'm console logging a variable b which is not present at all, I'm not getting any visual indicators that this is wrong. We can see that eslint is configured on this project because I see an eslint.json file. So the first thing that we need to do is install the eslint extension. So come to extension and search eslint and install this first one that you come across. So now we go to the eslint rc.json file. We need to convert this into an array and add one more configuration as the first item in the array, which is eslint colon recommended. As soon as we do that and save this file, we see that the index.js now is highlighted in red color. If we go there, we see two squiggly lines. It says A is declared but never read and B is not defined. 